being a coach of the Red Bulls, you know, is something that's never crossed my mind in my wildest dreams before this year. To step off the field after 13 years and know what I liked and didn't like, that's an invaluable experience that I gained. He's not too far removed from being a player. And so he understands fatigue, he understands the, the mentality of the player, and he understands setting our mindset. And every time he sets our mindset, I feel like positive results come forward. Mike every day brings 110% uh, uh, intensity. And like I said earlier, that's something that you can feed off as a player. And some coaches, they believe in a certain way. To some people, some coaches do it the other way. You know, but it's just, a, just like human, you know, everybody's different. Everybody got their own way doing it. And he's so passionate, emotional, especially the passionate part. I love it, you know. Mike is, a, is the type of coach that wears his heart on his sleeve. I think everyone is is that's you know pretty obvious to see um, but he's a guy that that's very smart behind the scenes he's always working hard and uh, I think sometimes it always looks like he's a little bit of a crazy person <laughs> but uh, at the end of the day his intentions are always right. Part of my passion on the sideline and my crazy antics is I kind of lose myself once the whistle blows to be honest with you and so much going through my head about what I want to see out there what I hope that they absorbed and part of me is envious watching 11 guys that I respect out there and I'm proud to coach, run around and do something that I used to do. I played with Mike. Uh, now he's my coach and he, he, you know his commitment and attitude are, are, are just what you need uh, at times to get this, this, this team going. Uh, in the beginning of the year, you know, he mentioned how long he's been a part of this club and you know how important it has been to his life and to his development as a player and a coach and you know he kind of just wants us to share some of the experiences that he had how special it is to play here in front of the great supporters you come to a club like this and you see uh, Mike Pecky and what the club means to him and the history that he has his process you, you can go and have, get any manager you want from out the world but if you don't really believe in the badge or believe in what you're trying to do then you know, there's no substance, and the one thing that drives me to Mike Becky is his, his passion for the players, his passion for the team, but the key is the fans, you know, um, he gets it, he understands, and this is what the club needed for years. Um, we don't need a name, we need someone who loves the club. I am who I am. Um, I'm not going to change. Ho hopefully my career is long and prosperous, and maybe with time and age and experience I'll settle down a little bit but uh, I'm not going to change who I am because of, uh, I'm in a higher position now. I'd rather be passionate about something, uh, you know, that I love and believe in than being fake and calming that down because I'm, perhaps that's what some people want. Well, this is who I am, get used to it. <laughs>